to see some of these, uh, especially the newer players, putting in a lot of effort to get those games, you know? Absolutely. And then, of course, we've got Wise playing Septile, uh, running around, you know, running amok in Canada, <laughs> causing issues there and telling people that, you know, he's just the master of the land. <laughs> and we're going in right now. This is going to be game one of a best of three set. That's what we're doing. All right. So let's see what, how this plays out. Just some, some neutral going on, back and forths. We've got SK Dale going for the Earthquake mix-ups there, actually. You know, uh, canceling in the air. Um, something that you don't see a lot of people actually make like use of, but yeah. I think it's a very good tool to just kind of try to bait something out from your opponents. Exactly, yeah. But we also need to be aware that Septile can, you know, Azuna drop that, that uh, he decides to jump back right in yep. the air. Yeah. Yep, yep. Septile definitely has quite a few answers to airborne opponents, you know, uh, that anti-air lasting a very long time <laughs> and just being very good and applying a debuff if he lands it. Yeah, exactly. And then, you know, the options, as you said, to jump back JY, uh, jump back JX, very good options. All right, so SK Dale taking that first round of the first game. Very, you know, large Neck amount of back and forth. Yeah, definitely. Okay, a mogul. Yeah, keep him out. All the calls getting a little bit of chip damage. Ooh, nice Ooh. tech there. Homing canceled too. Called out the grab, said no. And he already has his burst going. We've got the septile corner play. Very scary for everybody. <laughs> Alright, back in field. Let's see what he does here. Escadale making use of dig to try to get his way in and the cross under with the auto-corrected JX. Oof. Fought from behind. Taking it back. One more round at the side first game. Let's see how this goes. And they both have both have meter. Yep, both players having meter. That's very important going into game three because uh, you want to be able to... Most people want to save it for when they either really need it or when they just really want to establish their position in the round. Exactly. And so right now, you know, if, if, if I were SK Dale, I'd be holding on to the meter. Looks like he is. Uh, Wise might be looking to have to pop it soon because you never want to end a game having meter. Yeah, exactly. You want to utilize the resources appropriately. Absolutely. And with what uh, Burst can do, you know, it's very important to make use of it when you can. We actually saw SK Dale pop his Burst first, and then Wise responding with his Burst just so that way he can deal with the light armor from, from the Burst uh, Garchomp. And he's actually going to maintain quite a bit more meter. SK Dale no longer Dale, having first. You just play a little risky right there. And, uh, with the, what is that spin? It's, that, it's like punishable on block. Pizza cutter? Uh, no, he like... He went oh, at him. Oh, uh, 5x. Yeah. That's that's just straight up 5x for Dark Chomp. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Right, nice mix up here. That Sand Tomb is going to help push Wise back to the wall. Good counter on Wise's part. That Stone Edge, though. Uh, Kind of a risky play because it does leave him very vulnerable and gives the opponent lots of opportunity to do things. Mm -hmm. And he just went for it. Probably just red, maybe red wise. You know, we see, at least in Michigan, we, we see Garchomp's kind of like our local Garchomp profits. He, he kind of does that too. He'll just throw out the Stone Edge. Oh yeah. And it it's so powerful when it catches on. Definitely, yeah, I mean, the, the anti-meta meta is definitely a mix-up in itself, you know, picking a bad option because you know the, the best option is probably what they're going to go for, so psych them out anyway. Absolutely. I'll throw out a wild charge if I want to, I'm feeling <laughs> crispy. Right? Okay, so SK Dale, he now has the corner game, and it's almost just as scary as Sceptile, oh, yeah. just in a completely different way. If I'm ever in the corner with Guard Tom. <laughs> like the big difference being between these two is that like Garchomp, damage he's output. in your face and he's got the damage output. Yeah. Sceptile, he's holding back and staying at that mid range, and he doesn't necessarily have the damage output, but he's gonna juggle you for yeah, a definitely. day and a half every time he gets a confirm. He's also Ooh. got the ability to with Giga Drain yeah, right here, drain you know, right good there. timing. Um, spacing. Yeah. You know, he's got he's got the Giga Drain spacing and he's got the ability to steal your meter away and. Giga Drain also actually helps recover uh, recoverable health as well. So it's it just gives Sceptile a big position when he's got the corner to control to be able to 
to gain a lot of resources back. Yeah, true. SK Daily up going for the. Oh, that one's actually uppercut. Okay. Or not. I you, it's, go, it's you, can, you can go into uppercut after yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah. Our pizza cutter too. Yeah. yeah. Packing a Morgan. All right, so why is taking round one of game two going to be an important lead for him? We've got SK Dale coming in. He went for the fully charged. I respect it. Wanted to get that shield break maybe, but Wise was very ready for it. Said, ah, nice right I'm going to just JX. It's going to get me out of the way and probably punish what you're doing. Okay, all right. Uh, ooh, that was very nice ooh. usage of that vine. Big very up. nice run canceling. All right, not fully charging this time. Going instead to just catch him caught out. Him. Yeah, caught him yep. with it. All right, we do have Wise popping burst. He's going to want to try to end this game in this round. He definitely doesn't want to see round three here. Is that going to connect? Oh, oh no, just short of connecting, but it does Very put short. him close up. SK Dale not really afraid, though. I'm liking how he used the uh, Brokey just to, you know... <laughs> he just used that grab and kind of have Brokey double him. Yeah, it helps set up for a very nice, like, just... Just go in, not Pseudo even have to worry about it. Yeah, exactly. You know? Good double on part here. Oh, going first. All okay, right. going first. Dale does have that damage down debuff, Ooh, but the up, right the down. dig, down. the raw dig, is going to go into round three. Both players benefiting uh, with their synergy here. They're both at about 40 percent ish. Go, gonna win kills here. Yep. Opting to ignore the uh, starting nugget. And now we've got, like like we were talking about before, the very intimidating septile corner play. I see what you mean there. Yeah, you've you've got the seeds. Really yeah, you've got seeds set up everywhere. He can set up either the, 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 the leech seeds, which are the two, or the bullet seed, which is the one. You know, bullet seed covers jumps. Leech seeds are just, they stay yeah, and linger so long. And you know we see uh, we see a lot of septiles do that. We see uh, Thanks Wallet do that kind of gameplay, and Thanks Wallet will actually go into like he'll do Giga Drain sometimes. Sometimes he'll Giga Drain cancel dash up, and you know catch you jumping with Leaf Storm. It's terrifying. It's it's a game that you feel like you don't win ever. <laughs> oh, nice nice little combo there with a Morgan taking that second game. Nice, very nice little confirm off of a Mulga. Why is going into? Game three now because SK, SK Dale won game one. Very nice, very nice. One one. Let's see who takes it. Who do you who do you, oh, what character do you like, Shaftal or Garchomp? Did you ever see him see you playing either one? Um I've always played Shandy. I've always rocked the Shandy. I dig it. I, I did look at Sceptile for a short while, uh, just for funsies. Ooh, okay, right there. We saw uh, the pizza cutter usually unsafe, but because it was so low that time that uh, he was actually able to keep it safe on block just because of the height. Oh, so it changes on those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, the shield stun never really changes, but usually what what keeps pizza cutter unsafe is, is the time it takes to drop down from the air. But when you're low enough to the ground, it allows you to actually drop down, land, and recover and still be safe enough to not be punished by things like grabs, which are a very basic punish for Pizza Cutter, or uh, just Ooh. other stuff in general. Why is going very straight nice. in with a raw grab? Alright, alright, we're playing the game now. Oh, oh, We've got whoa. the leaves! That was dope. Those leaves set up to just kind of protect him. Ooh. We've got the clashes. I always love a clash. I always love a big clash. Clashes can be very hype. Okay, we've got yeah. the 5x. Very yeah, bad idea. Yeah, 5x raw. Is, or just yeah. favors the bowl, I suppose, but yeah. Definitely like, raw. If he, if he did land it, it would have given him the ability to uh, juggle him on the wall. Mm -hmm. It would have been very solid damage, but he didn't really have a health pool to give there. Yeah. So it's. It was high risk. No reward. Unfortunately, but. no reward. <laughs> Falling up with a combo there to punish that. We've got the leafs or the uh, the leaf blades out or the magical leafs. I think that's what it is. Why is going straight in for an actually pretty sizable combo for field phase? Frogadier. Why is entering burst? Uh, 
SK Dale is going to need to look to try to gain his meter here pretty soon. Oh, Ooh, boy. That, yeah. Spaghetti. <laughs> he did get the drill. Actually catching uh, wise. You can cancel Giga Drain? Yes. Wow. Yes, you can. Learn to the new today. Okay, SK Dale surviving the burst from Wise and the Sceptile, managing to avoid everything he could and getting meter. That's going to be a very big turnaround for him. Wise is going to have to play it safe, and he's already in the corner. So he's already in the corner, and right he's now. got a burst guard okay. chomp. Ooh, the frog! Yeah, frog a deer saved him. Break the this this actually might be dead. This should be dead for SK Dale. Yeah, yeah, but I forgot that forgot that. Yep, Gar Garchomp, uh, Garchomp burst. <laughs> Unfortunately, unsafe on shield break. Yeah. Uh, you know, you don't see a lot of things that break shields that are unsafe. <laughs> Garchomp Burst is one of them because for some reason the character decides he wants to take Oops. a quick step to the side Roar. and just rah, <laughs> right in your face.